Zini and and spooky season is coming up just around the corner and we're going to be talking about costumes and stuff so today I have some Halloween costumes that can also be cosplays and I want to pair them with some black fishnet tights that are from Germany and then I'm going to pair that with some other outfits and we're going to talk about them but first I want to show my outfit off and this is the cosplay Stellar Blade well from the game Stellar Blade and this is Holiday Rabbit and um so I have a leotard underneath to give it the updated version you know the censored version um but got the little the little rabbit tail and then it has the ears if I can show y'all the ears and then you can put the hood on like that obviously you have your hair in the back All right, we're going to start by showing you this is a German brand. So I have it um the the brand of it linked down below for well, the name. And this is a crotchless pair. As you can see, and it's a fishnet. It has a really really nice pattern. Um you'll see it better detailed when I put them on. It's a very very stretchy like most uh, fishnets are. So I'm going to put them on and show you the details up close. I'll be right back. Alright, so this is the pantyhose, the fishnet pantyhose that are crotchless with the cosplay Stellar Blade, the Holiday Rabbit. And this is around $20. And, um... This was actually out before the game came out, so they already had it ready and everything, so that's why it's like a little cheaper. Then most of the newer ones are really high because of the hype of the game and all of that. But here are the pantyhose. Let me show you all the details. See if I can get a close up. And got all the pretty So one thing to add about these crotchless fishnet tights is they're, um, they have a lot of room and it's stretchy. So it's not like your average stiff pantyhose. Like these actually give you more room to move and flex without it ripping. You have a lot of room and see how stretchy it is. Like these aren't your average, but I mean, fishnets are like that. So that's why I really like the fishnet. So, yeah. But they are, they accommodate bigger legs. I mean, you can have small legs too, but they can accommodate the bigger thighs. So you can actually move and not rip really, really easily. So I have another cosplay Halloween uh, outfit. Well, Halloween outfit slash cosplay. Whichever you prefer to do is DVA. And um, this is another affordable um, cosplay Halloween costume. <clears throat> and it's a leotard with this little zipper. So you could purchase these on Amazon for about $10. Other places might have $20. Depends on like if, wherever you want to buy them. They could be starting to get lower in stock because of Halloween coming up. So I would, you want one, you might want to get one now. They have Spider-Man and all, like a lot of different ones. I purchased pretty much all of them. But this one's one of my favorites and I love blue and they got pink on it and white and this is a zipper. So I wanted to try this on with these tights to see the difference, to see what it looks like. And um, to show y'all what it would look like with the crotchless tights. And I'll be right back when I put it on. 
Alright, so here are the pantyhose with the DVA. And I'm starting to think that these pantyhose are very versatile because as you can see, it just elevates any outfit or cosplay or Halloween outfit like the DVA. Alright, so my next cosplay Halloween suit is going to be Star Trek. And this is a gold and black, um, and it's got like a panty style bottom and then bra like top that kind of looks like a sports bra but is not like stretchy like a sports bra. Um, these might be, um, if you look for these on Amazon or other websites, they might be listed as a uh, bathing suit, swimsuit, something like that, but the material really isn't bathing suit material. So, um, I'm going to pair the, this with the fishnet crotchless pantyhose, and as you can see, this is gold and black, so this black is just going to make it pop and make it look more... Um, more of a statement piece. So here's the back and it's got the zipper and the front and then this this bottom part right here doesn't really hug the body as well as I would like. So it's not really like a bra fit but you could like make it like fit it a little bit um, by like a pin maybe in the back. But I'm going to show you what it looks like with these pantyhose and um, show you all the details and everything when I get back. Alright, so here is the Star Trek gold and black. And this outfit or cosplay is from the Star Trek uh, series Lower Decks. So that's what this is inspired by, the top part. Um, first, I want to talk about the top. So if you have a bigger chest, um, you might need some support since this bottom part, it doesn't really hug, so it doesn't give any support at all. So I would suggest either using a, a strapless bra or a, a strapless bra with the, um, clear, like, little straps that you put on it so it would, like, blend in and doesn't, like, stand out like a regular bra. But um, that's why I wanted to talk about uh, the top because if you and if you have a, a bigger chest, it might be an issue. If you have smaller, um, it might not be an issue. So you could or couldn't depends on how you you like your tops to fit. But just to be known that this bottom part doesn't hug as as you would like. So here it is the back. So let me know in the comment section what cosplay slash Halloween outfit you prefer, what's your favorite, and what do you think went well with the pantyhose that I have on, the fishnet pantyhose, um, which one did you like the best, and what, with the pantyhose, which one did you like? And I hope you liked the video, I have my the link for my Patreon down below. And like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you on the next video.